You know what this is? This is something that I don't use. Yeah, it's a pump that's gonna raise your car up. How am I supposed to get underneath there to lift it up to get the jacks there? That's the question why I cannot use it for now. Just take note, that's my jack point. Yes, indeed. Nobody knows jack points. I smell oil. Eh, because it's oil. This is too narrow of a point to get this off. I gotta go find a one inch wide screwdriver. By the time I start explaining and showing you what I'm doing, I'm already done changing my oil. Oh, just like the oil, almost looks like something stuck on. I can twist and twist and twist. A little pressure. Get rid of this Honda, we don't need this anymore. I just love noise. That's what you're gonna hear in this video. A ton of traffic, a ton of noise. Oh man, hand tight, oh man. How could you get your hands in there to take your filter off by hand? It's beyond me. Yeah, I could get it off by hand, but why when I got a tool? I heard it all, and I've done it all. I've been doing this for so many years that I'd rather, you know, let the tool do the work than the hand be so sore later in life when you can't open up your hand. Oh, I forgot. Camera magic. Ah! I used a ratchet. I used a socket. I'm loose as a goose. Lefty Lucy. Righty tidy. I forget, people don't know humor in life. They want seriousness. They want step-by-step -step instructions what to do. I do my best to show. I do it for all. I do it the unconventional way. Here comes the oil. Out it goes. Spilling all over the damn place just like that. What a mess indeed. I hate this oil container. Drippity, 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 drip. Oh man, did you see me change my uh, O-ring, my washer, my crush washer? Off camera, on camera, doesn't make a difference. I'm not waiting for my last drop, my last drizzle. You can, I'm not. I'm gonna tighten up my bolt because I'm done down here with this drain plug. Over here, concentrate on getting this off. Let it drip. Drip, drip, drip. And once the dripping is where you need to let it go, then you're simply going to take it off. why you wear gloves. Gloves are important so oil don't get all over your skin, but just on the glove. Take old oil, wherever you can get it, on the O-ring. What you're gonna do now is gonna clean up on top, over here. Clean, clean, clean. Get as clean as you want, all up to you. Now you're gonna take your filter. Oh, like everybody says, only hand tight. So that means go waste another glove, go put a rag. No, that means your bare hands on your filter. That's hand tight, clean. Clean, clean. Now do one of these, hand tight. And you don't need a tool. 
Don't use this tool to tighten up. Just go by the book. Find the torque for your plug, for your filter, for your J3s, for your 10 millimeter bolts. Find all that torque information online. 212, 1212. Get your J3s, get your 10Ms, get whatever you want, or throw this garbage plate out. You got the job underneath. Well done. Put your jack as far back as you can go. Lift and lift and lift until you can clear those jack stands. Ah, use your foot. Take it out. Pick it up and put away. Ah, do my best to lower my car. If I can't get this off by hand because of all that thing, I'm gonna go get a tool. Low, 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 out it goes. OW16, OW20, you tell me which is the better. Oh man, I don't know where to put my oil. Oh look, S-A-E-O-W-20. Doesn't say what brand, it just says S-A-E-O-W-20. Ah, 20 years old, still works, does a great job. Flowmaster, use what you got. I use what I have. I've already measured my ounces out. And here I go. Oh, you gotta pour real slow. Make sure you get it in the hole. And there you go with the oil. Don't you gotta go to the bathroom? Doesn't it make you go to the bathroom when you see your fluid just go? Don't gotta wait for the last drop. I'm done. Have I measured oil? It's contaminated by iced tea. Oh yeah, I'll save this for another day. Another car, another change. It's not iced tea. Oh yeah, all my oil's in there. I just gotta go clean this up now and pour all my old oil and go recycle. Ah, people will forget, man. They'll forget to put these caps on and they'll let the oil just flow right out. Ask me, I'll tell you. Nice and tight, check the oil if you like. You can start your car, you can shut it off, you can check that orange dipstick. All up to you. I know I'm good. But what if, what if you miss? Off camera, it's checked. I'm done. I start my car. Oh, how do I get the maintenance do light off? Do I hit this button? Hit it again. Hit it again. Go to the maintenance. Hit the maintenance. And nowhere can I change that. I need to change the oil as well as the canister filter. I go here, I follow all the information. It's gonna take me forever with this system. Oh man, vehicle. Oh man, go all the way down where it's not important. Oil and filter, all due items. It's not tire rotation. It's not all due items. It's oil and filter. If you hit all due items, you're going to erase it all. Or are you not? Reset. It's gone. Has been reset. And the oil is back 100%. If you do that and don't change your oil, good luck with you. Ah, uh, you can check everything else out if you like. All that good stuff. Slam the hood. But what's the matter with this? Is this right? Is it on? I don't know. I don't love it. Close the hood down. 
Ah, wrap it up. Oil change done. 2017 fifth generation, probably the 25th oil change. Have a great day. Enjoy your oil change vids. I'm Fish. See ya.